The state of Texas is home to the legend of El Muerto, which translated means the dead, and it's the Lone Star State's very own headless horseman tale. The story starts in 1850, when South Texas was known as No Man's Land. It was home to many outlaws and bandits. One particular outlaw went by the name of Vidal. He and his group of henchmen were stealing horses from the sparsely populated area. Little did Vidal know that when he stole some prized Mustangs from a ranch whose owner wasn't home, he would be making a fatal mistake. Just as he was unaware, he would become the subject of a legend that's immortal. That particular ranch belonged to famed Texas Ranger Creed Taylor. When he returned home and found his prized horses missing, he enlisted the help of fellow ranger William Alexander Anderson Bigfoot Wallace and a nearby rancher named Flores. Taylor and Wallace were expert trackers. They quickly picked up the bandits' trail and found their location. They waited until the bandits went to sleep at night and ambushed them. They killed the gang, but that wasn't enough. Taylor wanted to send a message to other outlaws in the area. So with Taylor's blessing, William Bigfoot Wallace took the body of Vidal that had been shot dead and decapitated it. They strapped the headless body to a horse and let it loose in the Texas countryside, and a legend was born. Sightings of the headless body on a horse began popping up all over South Texas. Soon the stories of El Muerto haunting the area spread. They eventually found the horse with the body still attached and gave the body a proper burial. The legend and sightings didn't stop, however. People have claimed to see the headless apparition riding around the area of San Antonio for the past 170 years. He rides at night, still looking for livestock to steal. Some famous sightings include a couple in 1917 traveling in a covered wagon, stopped for the night in the area. They awoke in the middle of night by the sound of a steed galloping near to find El Muerto sitting by a campfire. The apparition yelled, It's mine! It's all mine! Sightings have continued with one as recently as 1969 in Freer, Texas. So if you find yourself in South Texas in the dark of night, be on the lookout for the headless rider and his mysterious horse that apparently are doomed to ride together for eternity. So, legend fans, do you believe? Give us your theories or encounters in the comments below. Please like this video and subscribe to our channel and be sure to check out the link in the description to this video for cool merch of this legend and legends from around the country. See you next time, legend fans.